you had to take some punches in these first couple of rounds. What's the value in this team figuring out early on that they can take those punches and continue to survive in advance, as the old saying goes? Well, I mean, I think they, uh, s several of them uh, were part of the journey last year that led all the way to the national championship. We took some punches, you know, on, on that journey and, and had to basically endure them. That was the best part of embarking, you know, all the way on that journey to the national championship last year was these guys were able to kind of, the Perkinses, the, the Silas Melsons, the Jonathan Williams, the Killian Tillies were able to, to, to experience it, and now they're putting their own stamp on it. Mark, I've known you a long time, and, and the thing that I think is beautiful is that despite the success last year, I don't think anything's changed, but I do wonder how appreciably are things different when you don't have to carry around the, the burden of the question about what your program hasn't done because of what you guys did last year and getting to the final game? To be honest, I, it's nice. It's nice to not have to answer that question. It's nice to not open every press conference with it. it it's, I think it's nice for our guys not to have to carry that burden that has nothing to do uh, with them. We were, our feet were actually on that path, and we did it and walked it and experienced it, so we don't have to, like, hypothetically talk about it, you know, when we're meeting her in film sessions and all that. Like, hey, if we do this, 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 we can get to San Antonio. I mean, our guys, like, have experienced that and felt it and understand, like, no, we're going to have to weather some serious storms if we're going to, you know, we're going to get this done again.